How's your main doing over here? Uh, luckily, the Bowser counter pick did win him the last set, but now he's playing against Luis, so... I think I think this match is actually pretty good for Game & Watch, but you have to be very careful, especially like with Ivysaur and Charizard, because you can just explode. Like, an another back air would kill right now. I mean, this is the problem. Once you get Charizard out, like, one stray up smash is probably going to kill you. Exactly. The Nair coming through. Whoa. I need to do that more. That's actually really good. Take notes. Yeah, there you go. I will definitely keep that in mind for my next match. Okay, yeah. Down air is a little risky there, especially against Ivysaur. That up air will beat it eight times at actually oh, pretty much all the time it'll quit oh that's unfortunate yeah. i think that was earlier than it should have been yeah the di there is a little tricky because like you want to think you're supposed to di in but you're supposed to actually you're supposed to di in said di away to not get it by the mm, knowledge by the tipper yeah but anyway luis really fighting back doing a great job with no chair instead we're yeah. just trying to keep matt wex out of the zone you know you can still do this in game and watch definitely like, PT does not have the best disadvantage state, they don't have the best added shield game. So you do have tools that will work, but these disjoints from Ivy are gonna be very key here. I think we may see the Bowser come into next game. We might. I, I don't know if that would be better. Then you're actually susceptible off stage. Mm, true, true. Oh, that's a sweet spot, yeah, that's gonna kill. But I also think that Matt Lex wants to kind of brute force his way through it. I guess so. He wants that raw kill power. Yeah. Jesus can't do it, but right now, looks like Matt Wex doing a pretty good job here. Yeah. You see the Bowser's working out. All right, so we are starting Wave B, so if both of you are in Wave B, uh, you can, you, we can swap off now. Okay, yeah, I got to go to uh, I got to play. Okay, yeah. I got to do the same as well. Armor, take over. All right, y'all. Yeah. No, but it was a lot of fun. Thank you so great, much for being here with us. Great job. Great job, everyone playing, and shout out to my co-caster for us to close close out our block for the last ever Xeno. Glad we could kick it off with you guys. I, it still hurts me to hear that it's the last one, but where can they find you? Could not find me on Twitter right now because I'm private for jobs purposes. Of but, course, uh, of course. You'll see me around at locals, either here, Long Island, sometimes Westchester. I'm all over the place now. I got time. All right, and you can always catch me on Twitter at Arnie Hermes, but I will see you later. I'm Swiss Rider. It's been Gutbuster. I will see you later. How you doing? Peace.
Hey guys, how's it going? We are here at the very last Xenosaga, Xenosaga 55. I am Force Armor, and we just saw Louie taking it over Matt Wex. I'm not sure if that was game one or not, or... Uh, we can see on the venue cam that they're getting up, so that was the set at the very All right, least. so that means Louie Money taking it over. Yeah. Just kind of running running Matt Wex over with the Squirtle. Big yeah. body, gets getting comboed, and... Yeah, 